Live from the Broadcast Center in Los Angeles, this is KCAL 9 News at 8. L.A. County is dealing with a rise in COVID-19 hospitalizations. As the chief medical officer from L.A. Care Health Plan tells us, it's the highest now since late February. With the more cases that we have, um, we will see more hospitalizations, particularly in people who are unvaccinated and people with high-risk conditions. Um, so the more cases we have, um, even with these more highly contagious uh, forms of the virus um, that may not cause a severe disease, and there's so much protection that people have who are vaccinated and boosted, unfortunately, more and more people are being hospitalized with serious disease and the risk of death. Again, if you're vaccinated and boosted, still very good protection against serious disease leading to hospitalization and possibly death. Um, it's one of the most important things people can still do is get vaccinated and boosted. Go ahead and mask when you go to the grocery store, when you're in other indoor public places like malls. Um, don't wait for the mandate. It's still strongly recommended. It's summertime. Gatherings is a way of life. Um, one thing we can do to protect ourselves and others is go ahead and get a test before you gather particularly if it's going to be indoors um, with greater numbers versus smaller numbers, numbers of people. Asymptomatic infections still happen and can still spread the disease. Mm -hmm. So that's another thing people can do. Well, even as LA County is poised to hit the high transmission category next week, the number of hospitalizations went down a little today. The state says there are now 1,014 COVID patients in the hospital. The number went up in Orange County to 280. In Riverside County, it also jumped by 20 to 210.